Hello everyone, welcome back to another review with me, John. Today I'm going to be doing a review of a beverage that I received from Japan. And this is Mountain Dew Violet. It is a grape flavored Mountain Dew. There was a grape flavor that came out in the United States called Pitch Black. I'm not sure if this is exactly like that, similar to it, or maybe even completely different. Um, this can is 100 milliliters roughly the same size as the 12 ounce that we have in the United States. Uh, I can't read anything on here except for the fact that it says Mountain Dew Violet with Grape Flavor. Everything else is in Japanese. Well, it also has like a PepsiCo thing that I can read. That's about it. I don't always notice in the other countries they don't have the wide mouth that the United States does, but it does have like these arrows with words on it. Don't know what that says. But anyway, we're going to open it up, taste it. I'm going to taste it straight out of the can. I'm going to taste it in a cup. You know, because sometimes adding ice to it changes the, the flavors a little bit. There you go. You hear a little bit of bubble in there. It smells kind of grapey. Sweet. A little light grape flavor to there. Let's go ahead and pour it out and see what color we get. It's definitely a different color than the pitch black, which is a very dark black like purple. As you can see, lavenderish violet kind of color to it. One of the things I wondered about this is if violet was just referring to the color or maybe it has like a floral, flowery kind of taste to it. Very, very light in flavor for a Mountain Dew, actually. <clears throat> uh, it does, the grape flavor is more similar to what you would see in a Japanese grape flavored uh, thing. Usually in the United States it's more that dark purple Concord jelly like grape flavor. This is almost like a melon type of grape flavor. I actually heard about this because some store in the United States had shipped a bunch to it. It was one of those mall stores like Spencer's or Hot Topic. I forget which one exactly. But when I tried to purchase it from them, they had already sold out. But since I was looking for it anyway, just checked on eBay and got one. It's probably not tasty enough or amazing enough for this to be in demand to be brought to the United States. Uh, the flavor is actually on the disappointing side, just because it's, it's not really... It doesn't, doesn't have any pop to it, and no, nothing extremely special about it. It doesn't taste grapey enough. I don't think there's any floral notes to it at all. It's not terrible, but it's definitely not something that I, I don't think would sell very well in the United States. I'm going to give it a 6.5 out of 10, and probably not going to recommend that Pepsi try to bring this particular flavor to the United States. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video. Give it a like. Uh, subscribe to this channel for more amazing videos such as this one. And until next time, bye-bye.